Hi guys! In this video, I'm going to discuss on writing linear equation ax plus by equals c in the form y equals mx plus b and vice versa. The standard form of a linear equation is given by ax plus by equals c and y equals mx plus b. This is the slope intercept form. Let's have some examples here. Transform the following equations into the form y equals mx plus b. So number 1, 3y minus 12 minus 6x equals 0. So in here, to solve this problem, what you're going to do is you're going to put the y terms in the left side of the equation and the x terms and the constant term on the right side of the equation. So 3y minus 12 minus 6x, so we're going to remain 3y to the left side, and we're going to transpose negative 12 and negative 6x to the right side. So we're going to have 3y equals 6x, then negative 12 will become positive 12. Then dividing both sides by 3, we can have 3y over 3, then this is equal to 6x plus 12 divided by 3, the result will be y equals 6 divided by 3 is 2, so you're going to have 2x, then 12 divided by 3 is 4, so plus 4. So the answer for number 1 is y equals 2x plus 4. Then number 2, negative 5y plus 4x equals 20. So again, you're going to have the y terms on the left side and the constant term and the x terms on the right side. So we're going to have negative 5y, then 4x will be transposed to the right side. We are going to have negative 4x, then plus 20. Then dividing both sides by negative 5, we're going to have the result as y equals negative 4x divided by negative 5 is 4 over 5x. So we're going to have 4 over 5x. Then 20 divided by negative 5 is negative 4. So your answer for number 2 is y equals 4 over 5x minus 4. Then number 3. 4 times the quantity of x plus y equals y plus 6. So we're going to operate this one first. We're going to have 4 times x is 4x, 4 times y is 4y, then this, this is equal to y plus 6. Then we're going to transpose y to the left side and 4x here to the right side. So we are going to have 4y minus y equals... 4x transpose to the right side will become negative 4x, then plus 6. Then 4y minus y is 3y, then this is equal to negative 4x plus 6. Then dividing both sides by 3, 3y divided by 3 will be y, then this will be equal to negative 4x divided by 3 is negative 4 over 3 x then 6 divided by 3 will be 2 so plus 2 so number 3 is the result will be y equals negative 4 over 3x plus 2 next transform the following equations in the standard form ax plus by equals c so in here on the left side you are going to have the x and y terms and on the right side, we're going to have the constant term. So for number 1, y equals 5x minus 8. So we are having here x term on the right side. So we're going to transpose this one to the left side. So we're going to have negative 5x plus y equals negative 8. Then making this negative 5x here positive, we're going to multiply the equation by negative 1. 
Then multiplying by negative 1, the result will be negative 1 times negative 5x is 5x. Then negative 1 times y is negative y. Then negative 8 times negative 1 is 8. So the standard form will be 5x minus y equals 8. Then number 2. y equals negative 5 over 3x plus 12. So what we're going to do here is the same with number 1. We're going to transpose x term to the left side. So we are going to have negative 5 over 3x transposed to the left side. This will become 5 over 3x plus y equals 12. Then we have here a denominator 3. So what we're going to do is we're going to Eliminate this one by multiplying the equation by 3. So 3 times 5 over 3 will be 5. So we're going to have here 5x. Then 3 times y is 3y. Then 3 times 12 is 36. So your answer here will be 5x plus 3y equals 36. Then number 3. 2y minus 1 over x plus 2 equals 4. So what we're going to do here is we're going to cross multiply the equation first. So this is over 1. So we're going to have 2y minus 1 times 1. That will be 2y minus 1. And this is equal to x plus 2 times 4. Then operating this one. We can have 2y minus 1 equals 4 times x is 4x, then 4 times 2 is 8. So 4x plus 8. Then transpose 4x to the left side, and we're going to transpose also negative 1 to the right side. So this will become negative 4x plus 2y equals 8, then negative 1 will become plus 1. Then this is negative 4x plus 2y plus 8 plus 1 is 9. Then making this one positive here, so we are going to multiply the equation by negative 1. So the answer here will be 4x minus 2y equals negative 9. I hope this video helped you. If you have questions about the topic, please comment down below and see you next time. <laughs>